Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is Rob. In this video, I wanted to alert you really quickly about the new free Waves Cosmos sample finder. Let me pull up the web page here. As you can see right here, new Cosmos artificial intelligent or AI powered sample finder. And they also have a new CR8 creative sampler, which I'm downloading as we speak. Another thing that's going on is the plugin, well, it's not actually a plugin, it's a standalone, as you can see down here. It's a standalone application, and it finds all your samples. And it's really powerful. Right now, as you can see, the little squiggly line right here, or little waveform going up and down, it is categorizing all my samples as we speak, but I wanted to get this video up and let you guys know, because I'm not really sure how long this is going to last. But yeah, let's just check it out here. And okay, so we've got a search term here. So let's go progressive kick. See what happens. Okay, nothing happened. Oh, that's because I have reverb on there. All right, let's take reverb off. Oh, here we go. All right. There's all my progressive kicks. How many do we have here? Well, I've got more than that. So it's still categorizing, but as you can see, it looks like it's pretty powerful. Let's go vocal with reverb. See what happens. No results. So it hasn't categorized all. Okay, here we go. It's pulling up my vocal chops. But see, it's categorizing. Oh, wet. Vocal wet. That's probably the best way to do it. Okay, there we go. Wet chops. So here's all my female wet vocal chops. All right, so... But it's categorizing all my samples. It's still working. I don't know how long it's going to take. Hopefully it'll let me publish this video. All right, then when you, fi when you find something you like, just drag it in. Just like that. And you got it in your project. All right, let's see what else we got. Okay, so we're, we're pulling this up here. And okay, so we have all of these categories here. Okay, we got hits. So 2,900 results are coming up under hits. And also, so if I have all those hits, and let's call it percussion. So I got 176 results found so far. And then they also have this little zone here where you can kind of go throughout the universe. Okay. Little dots have are different samples. So that's kind of neat, kind of categorizes it into different sounds based on the region. But there's also another plugin out there that does this. Can't remember the name of it, but it's, it's not free. Okay, so let's clear these terms and let's do something else here. Oh, okay, so now it's got 8,000 results based on what? One shots. Okay. It shows that it sees 113,000 samples in my library. Okay, so let's go back to list here. Let's go back to compact list. And it keeps showing this wave alchemy sample pack that I have, sample library, which is very good. So I don't know why it's doing that. Probably because it's fully categorized it already. But it's still working. Anyways, check this out. It looks like it's something that I'm definitely going to use. It's going to really streamline my workflow. Let's find something else here. Let's go closed hat. There's all the closed hats. And yeah, see, it's got that wave alchemy categorized really well. And then the rest are still working. Okay. Yamaha. Why Yamaha? Okay. It's going into everything. Let's have, let's see if we can create a new genre here. Have a vocal chop followed by. Okay, so we're still searching here and, but it looks like it's really pretty easy to use. Awesome. I don't know what the, hey, not a bad beat there. So it looks like it works pretty good, and I will definitely be using this in future videos. I think you should go grab this, and I'll put the link in the subscription. Thank you very much for watching.